are. We're fightingline.com. Mr. Buchanan, I'm gonna call you Mr. Buchanan, playing on defensive line there. But uh, uh, how is it here? This is your, this, this is your second year or first year? I can't remember. That's my first year. Your first year here. Uh, how is it? Uh, it's great. Uh, it's an honor to be here. You know, um, obviously being one of, one of the players selected down here, it's a great honor. You know, it's really exciting. You know, being around all the other big top Big Ten players and the coaches, and you know, just you know, seeing everybody. It's a real great, great feeling. Uh, one quick question: Did you pick your suit out that you're wearing right now? Kind of. Um, I, I had a little help. Uh, I had a little help with the tie. Okay. But I, I did pick the suit. Okay. Okay. Um, New coaching staff, new coaches. Uh, talk about that. I mean, how's it going so far? It's going great. Uh, Coach Beckman, I feel like he's, he's been doing a great job. But you know, coming in, you know, he really wants to change the culture. You know, make make it a winning culture, and you know, everything we do, you know, he wants us, he wants us to win. And um, obviously, all the other coaches, you know, I'm, I'm very comfortable with them. You know, guys really like them. You know, they want to play hard for them. So. That's the first thing, you know, getting coaches that you want to play hard for, that you want to do, you know, what they're asking of you and you know, things like that. So everything's going, everything's going great. Coach talks about competition, putting in competition. I mean, from the minute you guys wake up to you go to breakfast and eating your eggs harder than the other person sitting next to you, that type of thing. I mean, you know, uh, talk about how he's instilling competition with you guys. Everything we do, um, we made an eggs comment. <laughs> everything we do, we're going to make eggs, make the best eggs. Um, you know, just stuff like grades. You know, we have actually have grade competition. You know, which is something we, which you know um, we haven't done in the past. You know, everything we did in our you know six a.m. workouts. You know, it's competing. It's, 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 it's you know the, the winner gets a prize and the loser you know the loser gets nothing. You know, we had our just from our spring game. You know, we, we had the uh, stakes and stakes and weenies. I unfortunately was on the weenie team. You know, my team lost, but um, you know just things like that. You know, just instilling the fact that you know everything you do, you need to try to be a winner. Does that kind of stuff motivate you guys? I mean, the fact that you had the weenies and everybody else chewing on the mistakes. I yeah, mean, that, yeah I, was, I was pretty upset. Um, I was pretty upset that I was I was on a weenie team, but you know, it, it it we understand the purpose. We understand the purpose that you know, like I said before, you, we we need to win. Everything we do, you know, it's, it's about winning. You know, bettering ourselves and 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 living up to our potential. Uh, I know the fans are going to want to know defensively. Uh, are, are we going to look at similar to what we did last year, or are there going to be some slight changes? I mean, what, what are we going to see from the defensive unit? Fortunately, uh, the defense that we're running now with um, Coach Banks is very similar to what we did last year. Um, it's a multiple defense. You know, it pretty much changes. You know, um, goes from a four-three to a three-four. So it's, it's been very similar to what we did last year, and um, we expect not to not to miss a beat. You know, we expect to still be you know in the top ten in the country, and um, that's our expectation for this year. All right. Uh, in, during practice, you guys were going against each other, seeing more of a pro-style offense, and, and now you guys are spreading it all out. And look at what what can we expect on the offensive side, seeing from a defensive side. We're gonna get a lot of guys tired. Um, it's kind of hard, you know, just, just from a spread offense. You know, chasing guys around, you know, east and west. You know, really making guys run, and, and uh, um, they're doing a lot of up-tempo stuff, which you know, I really. I'm not gonna say I like as a defensive player, but I know how hard it is to defend as a defensive player because you know, as soon as you you know make a tackle on the guy, the offense is already getting up on the line, you know, ready to ready to call the next play. I and mean, that's some of the things you know we've seen on our offense, and we think with the guys that they have, we're gonna, they're gonna be very successful at it. Uh, talk about the, some of the players that we know about, the Hawthorns and the Supos, and uh, tell me about some guys that are under the radar for Illini fans that they should be you know circling on the roster. From an offensive standpoint, I really think that um, Josh Ferguson, uh, running back, I think he's going to have a really big year. I think he really fits the offense, you know, things that they're trying to do. Um, so I'm looking for him to have a have a great year. Um, defensive wise, you know, we have a lot of proven proven veterans. So I think guys, you know, like Terry Hawthorne and like Jonathan Brown and Akeem Spence, I think they're just going to improve and you know become 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 some of the top players in the country. So those are expectations from defense. You know? And we also have other guys, you know, that we're looking at, you know, we're looking at that are going to be great players this year. Guys like Shuko Sani, you know, who's had some injuries. And, you know, other guys that are really going to, we think are come back for a really strong senior season.